Welcome to New Realities. I'm Alan Steinfeld, and this program is about the evolution of consciousness and who we are becoming as a evolving race of um, higher beings, beings that exist on a uh, superconscious level, beings that are rising above the material plane, but also raising the body up with us. So tonight's guest works on these multiple dimensions. He's a healer, he does distance healing, and uh, he's here to share who you are. His name is Eric Altman, and he's from Portland, Oregon. And um, what I liked about what I heard about you is that you can send transmissions of energy through the camera Absolutely. to the audience. Well, well, we'll do that. And then to like thousands of people at a time. Right. Well, well, yeah. I haven't reached a, a specific limit yet. I have no idea. But I know there's been in uh, maybe four million. One well, time. What, what exactly do you do? I mean, how do you do when that? When I do that? Yeah. Yeah. What, what happens for me is, is quite a quick process. Um, I just um, close my eyes and then um, quiet. My brain stops almost completely. And then I just put my attention, and I know what, notice what happens is, like, I'm not doing anything. I'm just um, focusing the energy just mm -hmm. out, and it, and it comes right out through my heart, and my heart gets hot in this area here. And then my intention is, is to send it to the people that are um, listening, or their intention is to receive. Well, why don't you do that right now to the ca mm -hmm. camera? What did you exactly did you do? So I just dropped my head, my brain stopped, and then um, just let the energy like come out of my heart. Yeah. And it will be recorded on. It will the... embed itself. Yeah. So anyone watching this, then they watch this, um, they'll feel a sensation like that is is coming out of there. Out of the television, yeah, out of right, the computer. Absolutely. Yeah, it's been done. I've been do I've done it many, many times. Yeah, 30, 40 times. So when I post this like online... Put online and, 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 and people can be sitting there and listening or watching. It wouldn't matter if they're um, watching something, but um, like I said, I've done it on the radio where it came over, you know, the speakers. And then, mm. then people have these experiences where something starts to happen in their mind, body, etc. So there's a healing that happens Absolutely. as they... As yeah, yeah. It goes to right... It, you know, it works in a hierarchy. It goes, it'll go right to the... You might say you have a stomach ache, but it might go right back here. Uh -huh. Yeah, which will unloose some, something from that. Kind of ah, of so you don't direct. Now, how? Because, like, yeah, I, when I was younger and less experienced, so mm -hmm. you would say I have a stomach ache. Put, I figure yeah, out, yeah, I yeah. figure out all why and yeah. what you need. And so now I just let the, uh, you know, the higher intelligence work. I just, uh, you know, it's a, I'm just a trans transmitter like an antenna. But but how did you figure out, or how did this come to you to do this? I mean, you were sure. a regular guy, right? Yes. Pretty normal. Pretty normal, yeah. I mean, you're... Well, you, I was very, yeah, I guess it was very me. sensitive, and so what I would notice, um, um, probably since the age of around 9 or 10, uh, in school, what I would notice more than anything, um, if I would start to get in trouble from a teacher, like, I know, all of a sudden my t uh, energy would go here. To and all of a sudden, we, yeah, and then I, I would watch, it, um, I was very sensitive to, like, people's response to anything, to any stimulus, and, and then all of a sudden, they're... they're reaction to me would all of a sudden turn and it would be more um, uh, collaborating in the sense of me as opposed uh -huh. to me getting in trouble and then I was like wow this is you know being that age <laughs> so, so I'd use this in every possible circumstance to wow. manipulate to get what I want uh -huh. to whatever it was and then then as I you know uh, matured a little bit <laughs> right. yeah so I started um, playing with it I played with it every day every day of my life every yeah. day you were playing with this awareness More, yeah it was just like, going oh, to, such a great toy going and to the heart initially yeah then then it would just start dropping it just started then I just started I mean as I was walking you know thinking listening whatever that would be the um, overriding 
um, aspect of my ex uh, experience in life. Yeah. It reminds me of Richard Bartlett's uh, Matrix Energetics. Have you worked sure, with Sure, sure. He yeah, says no, go, goes about, he talks about going to that space. Right, they work, yeah, they do seminars just to try to do that. Yes. And then it pops up into their mind again because uh -huh. they'll, they'll get some stimulus. It's like, right. oh, this, uh, I need to fix something. Their brain gets engaged. Uh -huh. Yeah, they drop out of their heart and then they lose their intuition. Mm -hmm. But you're in that space all the time. Yeah, I'm here, right now I'm here and my, my mind feels really clear. All it's fine. So, so two things are going on. I feel We're very engaged. interactive and it's right, fun, playful, right, right. and I feel really still underneath. Uh, yeah. Do you always feel that stillness? That happens all the time. Since you... I, since I was um, that, it, it started to happen um, more of a constant stream when I was around 16. About two days my fa after my father died, something like shit that I went through, kind of a real trauma with that. And then something in my brain just like even like dropped even more. And then when I was 25, it started to, it, it just didn't go away. Like it would, 16, it would kind of go in, mm -hmm. stay maybe even for a couple of days. But you might, you and I might get an argument. So mm -hmm. it would toss me out. I'd go to my uh, mind. Uh -huh. But after, when I was like 25, just a hair after that, um, it just stopped. It just, you know, I was doing things to, to help cultivate that. So you don't have a, I mean, you still have a mind that's engaged, oh, but absolutely. you don't. Like, what, but yeah, well, I think the fun thing about it because yeah. I do spiritual teaching too, because then I that's what I teach about. Like, you people think, Well, I have to go off to you know in India and sit there, then then live my yeah, life yeah, somewhere. Yeah. It's like, no, it's the opposite. You got you can actually be more um interwoven in, in the world with other people, you know. But then you have this other awareness that doesn't leave you. And how do you teach that? How do you it's it's through like the transmissions too help, it helps kind of um, it, it just like the uh, prospect of awakening or enlightenment, whatever one, or whatever uh, one wants to call that. It's, it's, it's always a, uh, it's a matter of subtracting, yeah, of taking away. It's not, so we think it's putting, we have to do something, add to. No, it's just taking away. We're already enlightened, so do we just, so just take away. Take away the mind. The things that aren't, that aren't there, and you can do, I just started doing that when I was 16, after one experience. I just started writing down the things that weren't essential for me. Uh -huh. And that's how you live? Yeah, then that's what, it took it away. Then I could see like the other, you know, if, I, if it's needed, my mind will show up. Uh -huh. But if it's not, and I, so that discernment is part of the, the you know, that, uh, part of that awareness for me. But day-to-day -day living um, in the world, uh, what's, that, what's, what's that like for you? It's, I mean, it's play, like I would say if you asked any of uh, the people I'm around or family, yeah, they said that I play all the time. That, that, right. that how do I get away with that? And right. why, do, why do you get to do that? And you, well, because you everyone gets to do that if they want to if do If they it. want to, yeah. But and no, it's like, and, and the, what happens, the productivity I, I, um, just goes off the chart. But I'm really, I'm not doing much uh -huh. during the daytime. I don't do much. I mean, do you have like relationships with people? Are yeah, you married, fine. kids? Yeah, I, mean, no. like I, I have, you know, Partners. relationships, partner. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. but it's different. I mean, different than... Different than, than a normal well, person. Yeah, I would or, say it because people will say like, you know, how do you get away with that uh -huh. sort of thing? And I, I said, I'm not getting away with anything. You well, know, what do you all, mean? Like, what kind of thing? Like, an Which is like doing what I want to do when I want to do it. Right, and, right, But, right. It's, you know, I have consideration for everyone. Mm -hmm. You know, if we're, we're friends and I would, I would just say, like, today I'd rather do this. Right. Even though we may have plans, I would just thank you that you would be considerate of that if it was really important to me. But if you, right. and if you, and if you said, this is, hey, this is the only time I can go, yeah, I could say, uh, okay. absolutely, I'll, I'll go for it then. I didn't all understand right. that. Right, right, but right. But still, it's that kind of just living in from that higher space. Then people get to, you know, it feels like people engage that readily. So I think it's possible for the whole planet to live on that. Absolutely, level. yes. So, but yes. how would you facilitate, how would you, from where you're coming, facilitate that place of living? Right. I would yeah. say that, yeah, that really to focus on, um, uh, or just be mindful, really, of what what gets in your way. There's probably two or three things for everyone. And, to, and, and again, um, not, you don't even have to develop a practice by any means. And I guess that could be a practice, but it's just seeing like, um, yeah, this is really in my way from being totally free, just totally like living. You're saying people heart. can see what's in the way yeah, of their they being know. We free. all know that. We yeah, all know We that. really do. So it's giving ourselves the credit for one. And then, then there has to be a willingness. That, I would say that is the absolute key of, of this whole process. There has to be like a willingness to do whatever, whatever it takes. 
whatever I see, you know, do I want to hang on to this and be in prison, or I'm willing to like kind of just let let go of that. So you feel it. you're you're free. You're absolutely. And I would way, say I, I would say like yeah, without a uh, without a doubt, I, I I would look at something if something um, came into my life after I was doing this for two or three years, like in yeah between sixteen. And, 17, 18. And, and the first couple of years was different like that. Then I was just very disciplined. Like I'm not gonna like um, allow something to like get in my way. That's uh -huh. not me. That's not serving my highest you, purpose. You you intended nothing. Very, and, but uh, that was it. Very single. But minded. now you don't have to. Now, no, that's just a short. It's a. I didn't know. I didn't know how long that would take. Uh -huh. Or there wasn't. I don't know for anyone. But um, but I think now is a, is a we we have such an opportunity because it's happening. So since we're doing it together, like as a, as a group, as a team. Oh my gosh, the, the the time flow it just gets collapsed down to like you know people could have this. because everyone's had more and more yeah, people absolutely. on the planet. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. And we partner, and it's very important to talk about to each other like talk what's about happening. what's in the yeah, way. Yeah, or you yeah. might say like this is happening for uh, me, and then uh, I could support that. Just uh, even you know not even talking. Oh, like that, that really annoyed me when you did that. Would yeah, I say something yeah. like that? Oh, anything, anything, anything at all. Just have no. Just there's no talk rules. about. For me, I would just say like, this is happening right now, and, uh, and then but in the beginning it felt really radical to people. But then they know that's who I am. That's that's that's. So you just, just don't hold back. No, you just, yeah, yeah. just and then, like yeah, and, yeah. And I see. And so. And it's fun. I've never, you, you know, people get mad in there, but they're mad at me, and their their anger, their face will even change from. They're still mad, but, but I'm not. I'm not making. So fun, if you have a I'm thought, you real, say it. You yeah. say, "Oh, I want to do this with yeah. this person." And, yeah, I think and, you're an asshole uh, you know, because you yell at me. And it's like usually it's just 99% of the time. Then it comes down to we're both laughing, but it's a, there's a mutuality there. It's not like. Because, I'm getting something, or you're getting something. Because you haven't held anything in no, or no, back, yeah. and it's out, and yeah. it's free. It's fresh. It's very fresh, and it's like then people can feel inherently they don't out to their mind. That's not. It's never ever personal. So, so you have you freedom to then to come back. Yeah, to your exactly. And it yeah, goes the really next fun. person. Yeah, so then, that, the, then we get close. We get very intimate. That's the only way we can become intimate, knowing mm -hmm. I can say anything I want to you, and then we become more mindful because then it's like, of course, wow, we're playing. You're coming in the pool with me, and vice versa. So it's yeah. like, wow. So when we say that we're there. We're I'm not going to say just stupid. Things. I'm going to no, say no, things that no. are important there, yeah, and meaningful that are, that, are, that, are, that are, come up for me, and you're going to say things that come, and we share it right there. Right in the there, minute. yeah. It's, and it's, it's like life. it's just like it's, it's a lie. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, 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 and that, that's super. <laughs> it's common. contagious. It's yeah, because like, we know that's it, that is us, and so mm -hmm. so we're 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 drawn back there. It's not oh. like a. Uh, so any like thought you're thinking about somebody, you just yeah. say, "Hey, yeah. look at look at you guys. Yeah. Look what are you doing that?" And yeah, like, I've never like attacking something. It's because he, it he's just like me. No, yeah. like when I see him, like mm -hmm. there, mm -hmm. uh, it took me to cement. So, so I can see the light in him. That's mm -hmm. the same light in me. They're mm -hmm. we're, we're brothers, and so it's like, what you know? So, so I can say anything I want, knowing that that. that yeah, he can he he can get mad, but I know that the, the, the lifespan will be about this long. Of his of his madness, <laughs> yeah, it, can't, it can't hold up underneath that love that that's coming between us. I mean, this there, uh -huh. and I, so I'm not I'm not holding it back. I'm not gonna you know I'm mm -hmm. not gonna spoil my life, yeah, and, yeah. I, and I'm not gonna like why would I I'm disregard him that way? Uh -huh. It's one of the most uh, aggressive things that we can do by holding back our love for right. for for our brothers and sisters. And, right. and I don't mean that in a you know kind of the, the old sense way or a corny right, way, right. but it really is it's, it's there. We need to say what's true. But you're playing with people who know the game. I mean, no, not at all. Oh, okay. no, 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 because okay. that okay. often has happened to me. It has. My parents would say, "Oh, well, you, you know, you know, you can get away with that." Right, right, right. Yeah, so they would go. I would hear them talk about their friends, and mm -hmm. so we'd be out. Then I said, "Wow, you're, you know, you're so selfish. How come you don't ever treat your wife differently?" <laughs> you know, my parents would just like go like that, walk away, they'd walk away. Uh -huh. It's like they said, "You're." But you there. needed to say that because that no. person needed to hear and then, it. And so whatever they said, they said. But you, you can know, be off yours. sometimes a little bit from your own well, judgmental. What? That's absolutely true. But when, uh, like anything else, when we get used to like um, mm -hmm. doing that, mm -hmm. where our attention, our our awareness expands immensely. Uh -huh. It's just because there's freedom to expand, and then it's like because we're not we're not trying to block something out because you know oh he's bugging me. Yeah. yeah. So I, and I can't say that I want to talk to you. Mm -hmm. But that just goes away if you. But if, what if, if I have some held back stuff for years I needed to say it and then it just like all pours out at some point. Yeah, this, I would just say that. You just like, you know that if you know it's like that's all held back stuff so some of this might drip over onto you. So you say that there's some of this yeah, stuff. Yeah, uh, because it's uh, just and it's a, the learning curve is so. Is so 
so short. Yeah. Right. But we'll right. do that in bits, and then we'll get a bad. You know, I'll give you a bad reaction because you only come halfway. Uh, and I think like, wow. You know, I can't. I don't know when you're gonna go off on me. And does that make sense? No, no. Say? What's the last part? Doesn't make sense. Because if I if I only go halfway, then I if pull, I only tell you half. Yeah. The then stuff I watch is. your reaction. And I feel like he, you know, you're getting mad at me. So then if I pull it back. Oh. And then you get half, yeah, you get half of what's going on. Oh, and I pulled my heart in. And it's like then, then you really get. Oh, so you're like really opening your heart, heart as you, you oh, absolutely. as you yeah. share because, yeah, that's this not, stuff. It can't get out of my head because I'm not. It, it, the only reason we can get angry, we go to our head and make up a story, and then I project onto you. Uh -huh. But if I'm just here and I'll say like, oh my god, what a jerk! How come you didn't get me water? You gave him two glasses of water. <laughs> You know, and, and, you know, I'm just saying things that are true, and yeah, then you, yeah. could, you might start laughing, just like, well, I see. So how do you, you get mad say at it. that? You, know? you say it, and there it's out. It's out. So, but if you didn't say it, you take that with you, and right. then you, I see, so, that's, is that, is yeah. that like a satsang when yeah. you does that? Yeah, we do it, it's like when the people come, um, I have these satsangs, and then when it gets going, people in the beginning, they'll like kind of be standoffish, but... Everybody jumps in the pool because it's uh -huh. like, well, this is like, it's like well, 70 year olds. It's just like, well, you make old. it a lot of fun because it, you don't have a lot of stuff or attachment or no, anger, even. No, right, right, right. well, you can't. I mean, like, because it can't build, like, there's nothing to stick to because right. anger just sticks to itself. Like, anything attracted like will always attract like. So, so, how does that whole way of like being connect with the healing that that dropped in healing? So, because it like for one it opens the channel, and so that the heart, the heart energy is a is the energy that's actually moving out. Yeah, uh -huh. that's, that's moving out. The field around the heart is so so much um, bigger than the, than our auric field. I mean, it's it's, it's a big bubble like uh -huh. in front of us. So you by by being so honest and open, you're activating yeah. the heart field. Yeah. That it's, then. Um, yeah. That then activates this movement of energy out. Right, um, and then and, and like, but it has like what you said earlier. It does. It has its own inherent intelligence. So I don't ever try to like manipulate that to try to think. You know, even what like I said earlier, even if he tells me, you know, this is hurting or this or whatever. Yeah, I just let the energy has. I just I know I trust it in that in my heart mm -hmm. that that. It's not. It's not me. So it's just running through me. I'm just like a, you know, like this vehicle that, that and uh, and so now it's very um, uh, poised for that. So as, as soon as I put my attention out there, it just starts running through. Uh -huh. Yeah. You know, it's amazing. You look like sort of an accountant, stockbroker kind, kind yeah, yeah, of yeah, guy, yeah. and I would <laughs> never expect you were this you know being that just <laughs> had transcended all yeah, that yeah, yeah. kind of yeah. stuff. So do you have like um, teachers or spiritual um, connections that I, you're aware of? I would start. Um, I started reading some books just because it was fascinating. I didn't mm. then I couldn't talk to my um, buddies about it or, or friends, girlfriends, or whatever yeah. you want to call it. But um, yeah, there's a lot of teachers I like. Um, Who do you like? Well, I like Audrey for one. Audrey Shante, Shante. Yeah, yeah, nice yeah guy. I like him very much. Yeah, because I think he he's very like handy. But I don't think he's, he's very... as playful as you. No, he seems a no, little he's more... a little bit stiff. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, nice Sorry, guy. Yeah. Sorry, it's okay. I mean, yeah. It's okay. <laughs> he needed to hear that. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But he is rigid, and uh -huh. and I think that may come from the teaching, you know, from the, how he was taught. Too. Right, because you're not coming from a tradition, no, right? You're no. just like off the cuff. Yeah, because I think it's like uh, like there's some there's some excellent like information for sure but I think like anything like something that was taught um, mm -hmm. English that was taught in 1800 or something you right. know, we, we wouldn't even put up with it today uh -huh. but, but, but these other teachings we do mm -hmm. but, right. but when I look in their systems and so I would ask different teachers currently yeah how many uh, people will have I had awakenings through that process, through that right. teaching, through that that's, teacher. That's, that's a, what's always a mystery to me. It's like a, nobody, no one, no one. Yeah. So two thousand, three thousand yeah, years of Buddhism, and yeah. five people wake up, right. or Hinduism, yeah, or there's something, oh, yeah, there's a few, yeah, but, but not considering the millions but, and millions but you would of say people. Like any doing, other business, <laughs> they would be <laughs> There's a few successes, and most, yeah. yeah, yeah. So this cuts through, and this is what I'm into, cutting so, through all the dogmas yeah, so of all the one. All religions, yes. so, so everyone... So everyone can, can, can wake up, can have that, that is right at their hand. Yes, so you feel right. you have awakened? Absolutely, yeah. Uh, no, but do you feel there's more no. of an awakening th yeah, yeah. for you? I, what I've noticed is that it kind of keeps, it keeps um, moving. And I think it, um, when, when tapping into others that have um, 
went before in that area. I think that's sort of the case. I don't think there's there's a stopping point. At but all. you know, when I've asked like Advaita teachers that question, are you awake? And they would say, well, there's no one here to say that they're awake. Yeah, so yeah. you know, that's just yeah, garbage. Yeah, it's isn't garbage. It, it is. It's hard water. <laughs> I mean, it's a it's a it's a, it, it's, it's a, like the smoke screen because because obviously the they're person, there. The yeah. first thing I mean, because it's like what? What does that mean? It's like so. Then the right there, it creates the these non-dual teachings. They're so dualistic. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right? When they say, "Well, there's no one here," it's like, well, you they know. think like they're know, not their personality. I, I get it. But no, you're get not. That, yeah. But you're not making that um, separation. No, not at all. Ah, mm -hmm. that's, that's refreshing. What, well, it's refreshing because then it does um, avail itself to everyone. This, this taking that step and oh wow you, you know, should go to the non-dual conferences and, and talk about this I would this. love uh, that yeah, yeah. I know I Maurizio LA, but I, I, uh, I will tell Maurizio about your okay. original non-dual uh, right practice of yeah. telling people off. <laughs> yeah, I would like that. Yeah. And just it's be, fun. I would, yeah. I would challenge many people No, because, you know, area. Jeff Foster, you know him? He, he comes from a similar place. I've and heard of There's a couple him. of people I, who, I don't know. who yeah. saw the, the Advaita Nandu trap right. of those things yes. and transcended yeah. that. So, but anyway, it's not about any of that nonsense and tradition. No. It's just about... Yeah, it's like you and I are sitting here. We have how, I mean, it's so if someone studied right. something and then, so then they come and teach us something. There's, yeah, there's some trapping in that. Yeah. Yeah. For sure, it's very uh, prisony. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you and it's dull too. It's so dull. to me, like a, it's, it's a of, there's a lot of laughter, joy, because that's what we're, that's what we're made of. Mm -hmm. So the other, it has to be painful to like sit there and be so mm -hmm. serious, mm -hmm. you know, and teach. <laughs> so what do you want to say to people then, if you want to like get them? I mean, just as like freeing them out of that stuff. Yeah, I would say yeah. Look to yourself and and play like how. Have a lot of play. That's an indicator of awakening. That's an indicator of um, taking a risk, of being courageous enough to like to um, be truthful to yourself and everyone around you. It's very contagious. I can't say say that enough. That that, that um, it just it just uh, grows on itself, and then it grows um, internally very very rapidly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't. No one turns away from having fun. It's like but, very, that childness in all of us. But you do seem a little nervous about something. I don't know what is it. I was trying to kind of, with you. It was. It's hard to um, like uh, put words to that. Oh, okay. Like how easy it is. Like how that the play of that where where it's easy to get. Um, we can play maybe with a certain person, but then qualify that, and then it gets serious and heavy again. Right. So, but if we if we just look at that across the board, like I could hang out with him forever. I don't even know him. But He's I'm a sure good we'd, guy. Have, we'd have a great time. Yeah. I just and the, so I think you should. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you need and then some of that. Yeah, we, it's just it just it strengthens that in me, and mm -hmm. then then I'm sure that it would in him too. Yeah, it just organically, but it wouldn't be me doing anything. We'd just be playing mutually. Yeah. yeah no, I think it's beautiful what yeah. you're saying and sharing. And uh, so, what would you say? What 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 do you get from me? Well, uh, holding <laughs> back just a little bit, kind of questioning that part uh, okay. of the seriousness. Ah. Uh, Wait, me? No, yeah, like that, that, uh, um, because like, it's like your heart is like bursting, like at the seams. And it, like it's, open expanding. Yeah, yeah, it's like it's, it's sitting back in the, in the, and it's pulled like, and it's like. Because oh. I'm being serious, isn't it? I would say like that, that you're on the fence. There's something on the fence about you. Uh -huh. About like, man, I, I, did, I need to just. I mean, I could, I, you're saying it's like, I. Yeah, I can just play all the yeah, time. Yeah, we were as we were talking okay. earlier, okay. and then it's okay. like you started to get into okay. that, and all of a sudden I could see your your whole field. I that opened up. Like, oh my gosh, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. So you see fields. That I do see. Uh, yeah, uh, and you can see where someone's holding in the. Yeah, I can tell someone's you know uh, hedging so or whatever. So when we were playing, I was yeah. like expanding, okay, like, and, and then we like, then uh, I pulled back like a little. Like boxers in a ring, but we're just sparring kind of like uh -huh. it's like kind uh -huh. of a tap or kind uh -huh. of you know, but. It's so all playful, and that then it really enhances both of our experience. Uh -huh. yeah. So the more we play together and just let it, then the, our fields just just. Oh right. yeah, that especially uh, our heart uh, naturally uh, will come out, and then uh -huh. then we can go. You can go play with someone that you did you haven't uh -huh. before in uh -huh. a different way, and then then that field will connect with, with uh -huh. that. That will be the predominant experience uh -huh. going on, and so yeah. So the more you do it, it just keeps getting bigger. And, and so as we you walk around, people will actually they'll come to you, they'll come to you like the people will come, they'll walk uh -huh. around me who I don't know. I'll go downtown. And then people will start kind of just chatting with me right so away. So we want to play with the whole planet that yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't want to. Yeah. So that, do, do you have a vision of that's actually? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, yeah. I think I think you got it's coming. Some. It's coming. It's coming quick. I mean, it's just we. Oh, we have to just look at it, look in the eye. Yeah, do you feel yeah. like the energies of this year are particularly changing for the Yeah, reason? absolutely. What's what do you see happening? I, I see like it's um, it's speeding up so much that that that. Um, 
we were trying to hold on and so uh, thank god you know it's like a um a force of nature mm -hmm. you know obviously but uh the speed then we can't hang on to these little things anymore mm -hmm. yeah we're gonna have to like let go or just or, or probably mm -hmm. leave the planet our bodies will leave mm -hmm. the planet quickly but we can play like that. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Yeah, the only thing that stops me is the sense of sort of responsibility. Uh, this idea. Yeah. This idea. Yeah. The, yeah. the idea of it. Yeah. So how do I do with that idea? Because, you know, like with, with children, I, so I don't know if you have children or not or have had children, but... Um, the, I'm around the, children. Yeah so, yes, yeah, so so when you get along, when you hang out with them, how do, I mean, you, I'm imagine right, you They get with upset, them. they get mad, they, yeah. and they're happy the next moment. Yeah. yeah. That's all it is, and so, so all the, all the friends that, that I hang around with um, are the same thing. They always say like, "Yo, you know, it's, let's go hang out. It's so much fun." That that would be the first word that would come to their with mind. With you, yeah, absolutely. Because you're like this all the time. All the time. All the yeah. time. Nothing. Yeah, I'll gets... notice like if if something gets the other way, I'll just I'll kind of laugh at myself. <laughs> I'll, I'll be talking to myself that way. Uh -huh. like, you know, I'll get right back to you. Uh -huh. you know, like I'm, I'm having fun here right now. So, what would you do for my friend there behind the camera? Well, this, uh, he take, uh, he takes himself so seriously, and he's kind of like downtrodden because like life is like so heavy <laughs> and there's so much. And yeah, well, if you just take off his shirt and kind of go play. Yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah. just cut loose, really. Cut loose. Yeah. 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 Cut loose. Yeah, yeah. he's very. His heart is amazing. Like yes. Yeah. Like, naturally, true. has amazing heart, and so like that. Um, some people, it is really. You know, we're not all the same, and so like his. His is like is very thin. The the layer is thin for it to pop. Right. So again, like this would be a perfect example. It's like he doesn't have to wait years for sure. No. I mean, it could, it could it could you know, be tonight or tomorrow or, or right now. It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's for any any. And time. it's popping into the freedom pop, of yeah. of just being yourself. Yeah. So we could, to just start speaking that that draws the other, that draws the stuff the the. Um, a non-essential out of our being. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like that poison. It's like kind of extracting poison mm -hmm. out of our system. The stuff that's in the way. Yeah, that, absolutely. That, that yeah, by speaking, because when mm -hmm. we speak, even like maybe we have mm -hmm. something right now, mm -hmm. but then then I kind of maybe it's anger that I express, but then that it'll start uh, pulling out, extracting yeah. all the anger that's in me. Not all of it the first time, but it's, but you'll start to feel the looseness of like. Oh. How do you do that? You say by. But I say I, if I'm angry at him and I start to express that and it's new for me, but it starts it starts to find that thread uh -huh. and then it, it starts pulling it out. So the next time I get more loose, that it opens and starts pulling it more and more because uh -huh. that's that's just a defense for us. Uh -huh. So we'll start pulling out any of the kind of the poisons that we realize in with our heart is much more uh, is uh, stronger than any other kind of experience we can have or um, any any other way that we can articulate ourselves in the world. It, it dwarfs that by five or six hundred times at least. Our what? Our heart. Our heart, our heart yeah. Energy. Our speaking from our heart, heart yeah. Uh, it just comes out of our heart. You know, people use that term, speaking from there. For me, I think it's just more organic than that. It's just, that's who we are. It's our heart, our, our own love, our own love right. for ourselves. And then... So in a way, is that all you, I mean, I'm not saying that's all you have to say, but in a way, that's all you have to say. Yeah, so yeah, I don't, yeah because <laughs> any more than it starts getting, you know, Into I, mental I, I understand, you know, kind of almost every system there is out there as far as, you Spiritual know, systems, spiritual ideas, system. yeah. Yeah, there's, and, and, and I've chat, yeah, and talked to many people. But you're that. here to enjoy, live life, have fun, yeah, and play. Right. And that's and why we... the most responsible way, that's really taking responsibility for yourself at the highest degree. You know, which, to go which to, would be what, the highest yeah, it's still like yes, be who you are. Like let 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 that out instead of like um, you know people might say uh, different teachers might yeah be as you are or something like that. But then people I think misinterpret that oftentimes. Right. Yeah, they're not really just being you know as a human as we are right mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. We came in that form to to help um, clear those densities. So, yeah. so everything's really fresh for you all the time. Absolutely, it's because yeah. I don't know what you know. If I might tomorrow, I don't know what's going to happen, <laughs> and I don't pretend to, and I don't, and I'm not interested in it either. Wow. Because yeah, that would, I would be missing right here. Mm. Like tonight is really fun. Oh yeah, like it's beautiful. It's playing. Thank you. Yeah, it's very wonderful. So, <laughs> just to re thank you. So the way to remind me then to keep expanding is to. What? I would say play. Uh, play. Uh, that would be like a key, okay. you know, like a button on Just keep playing. Okay. Just to play. I, yeah. Like actually when I'm in the role of like interviewing, yeah. I, I don't, I, I forget like, you know, I think I have to do it for somebody, but I'm, I actually am doing it for myself. Absolutely. And yeah. it helps me. And by even supporting, and we, to me, we're, it's very, it's been like 50-50. Yeah. Like we've been playing just rolling yeah. roll, along here. And then, <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's nothing that I'd rather do. But anyway, that, but uh, anyone then can do 
Is that energy you just moved? Yeah. Just, what was that? This, yeah, kind of supporting that whole what was going on. <laughs> but so you're you're seeing the energy and playing with the energy mm -hmm. and expanding mm -hmm. the energy, mm -hmm. and that's what we all can do all the time. Yeah, absolutely. Yes, with uh, yeah, through so through through our heart, you could almost play with that. It's a nice way to breathe in through our heart and out to open that more, just to get mm -hmm. the the muscles, so to speak, working, and the idea of that, and to play with, with you know someone across the room. Yeah, yeah. I know it'd be great to have you back on and do a panel with a couple of people. Sure, like, uh, that'd be nice. There's a couple of people, in New York, you know, Locke Kelly, he's a student. Of, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and a couple of other people coming from a similar point of view. Yeah, I'd love that. So, yeah, that'd be fun. Thank you, yeah. Eric. Yeah, thank you um, very much. Yeah. You feeling energy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, just tell people how to find you or reach you. or. Oh, uh, ericaltman.com. You can go there. And I have um, a... Um, Nonprofit organization too that I support. It's called Living Peace International. It's uh, I founded it just this last year. It's a lot of a lot of the proceeds that um, uh, that come from my um, teachings and also like the work I do where I get paid. Like most of that, I just I put in, mm -hmm. yeah, for people out in the street and. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you said to me you you, you beam this healing energy to eighty thousand people in India. Oh, yeah, at least that many. But they could beam it to the themselves, though. No, I, I mean, in a while, I'll teach them that. Yeah. You know, when I have, I can go over go there, there and I'll take, I'll take a person from the nonprofit because there's lots of people who want to do that. So, so mm -hmm. I'm teaching them right now. Thanks. Yeah. Thank you, yeah. Eric. Yeah, Eric thank Altman, you very much. Yeah. Alan Steinfeld for New Realities. Um, that was fun. That was really fun. <laughs>